Good morning, guys. It's 4 45 a.m. <laughs> and I am already at work. <sighs> My new life. I'm like medics, medic hours. So, so this vlog will also show you or highlights a lot of the processes that I have on a day to day um, that help me to get it all done. Because as you guys can see, the struggle be real for army moms, but it's cool. So let's go ahead and just get into the vlog. Hi loves, I'm Renee and welcome to my channel. In this channel, you will find family vlogs, makeup, beauty, hauls, all the things that make me who I am. We have four boys and one girl, so we definitely have a lot of excitement. And I'm an army mom, look at that. So I wanna share my world with you, share our family, share our day to day, let you know that you can be a mom, you can be a wife, you can be all the things that you wanna be, regardless of where you are in your journey, your journey counts and we're gonna get there together. So if this is your first time, hey, I'm Renee. Please like and subscribe, join the family. If this is not your first time, thank you so much for sharing our world with us. And guess what? We're gonna go ahead and get into this video. Let's go. Guys, I had to stop at Starbucks. Like, I needed some energy. Just got a cold brew with the salted caramel foam. I don't know, so good though, so good. It is 8.44, I've been at work since five. Your girl is super tired. I just got my pick me up. Uh, so I'm going back to the office. Kind of was on a good roll, um, just getting everything done. I do like being there before everyone else just because it's super quiet, I can get a lot done because my mission isn't, isn't like, uh, we don't really work with anyone else but our team. So. This little thing right here is one of the systems that I have in place. This I got for at home with Kita. It's uh, Fancy Plans was Miss Fancy Plans, or I think she's just gonna do Fancy Plans now. This is a laminated sheet for a shopping list. So throughout the week, I'm always noticing that there are things that I need, whether for the business, for our home, for the kids. And this is something that I can just keep on my desk. I used to keep it in my planner. But now I just keep it on my desk, kind of, and uh, stick it in my planner at the end of the night. But it's something I can update. Um, it is like dry erase, so I can change it. And I'll just do like weekly or monthly or until I fill it up. So right now, things I know that I need, which is crazy because I went to the grocery store not too long ago and I didn't get olive oil. So this is something that I always have to like keep going because if I don't do like a list, I'll just completely forget about it. But if I have a running list, I kind of remember what's on my list. Oh. Another system that I have is just having an active running planner. So I am using the Happy Planner right now. It is uh, the big planner, which I really like using the big one because of the size and the space that I have to write, but um i don't think i really like the dashboard layout so i'm gonna do something different but it just keeps me straight it keeps everything that i need um, in order whether it's for myself for my job for my kids for school it's just i'm very visual and i'm able to write everything down so having an active planner if you're not like a hands-on type of planner there's planners on your phone i use um artful something I'll I'll show it um, the one that I use the app on my phone also have work planners um, there's like so many different things but just writing down what's important to keep yourself straight especially if you have very busy days like me so.
All right, guys, so I am home from the gym, a sweaty mess. Um, and I'm gonna show you guys a couple of my other processes that I have in the house. All right, love, so I am in my laundry room. <laughs> It's a mess, right? It's a mess because I have a large family. We are in and out. We are very active. My husband has a business. Like we just got a lot of moving pieces, but this system is what helps me a lot. We do laundry just about every day, like legit every single day. And laundry is a lot and I don't have time to do everything for everyone. So I have to have a system in place. So it makes it easier for me. So this is my laundry system. This is a... It has four baskets, but Dylan actually has his clothes to put them away. But these are baskets that hang here, are easily removed, easily put back, and and they are right on the opposite side of the dryer. Don't mind my mess, <laughs> right? So as soon as I take something out of the dryer, I go ahead and put it in whoever basket it belongs to. So the boys have one. Um, Octavia Renee has one. I have one. Depends on what I'm washing that week. So I don't wash the kids' clothes every day because I do allow their baskets to get relatively full. But I might be washing my clothes and the linen. So it'll be like a linen basket. Octavia Renee always has a basket because sis gets something washed every day. But this helps me to easily separate the clothes. And then when baskets get full, I can remove it, put the clothes away, put the basket back. So it allows me to sort. Everyone can see when their clothes are full and it allows them to pick up their stuff and keep just the laundry rotating and everyone not waiting for me to have to wash dry sort put away this gives that accountability to other people in my house as well so i love this system this system helps me tremendous all right guys so i don't know the state of my fridge but we're gonna go in here because i'm going to show you another system so for me marinating okay so th this is real life and when you have kids and stuff like this is my little liner and it's just all over the place. But marinating food the day of or the night before helps so much. So this is just a pack that I got from um, the the commissary. It's just a grill in a bag. So I clean the chicken and put the chicken in there, let it marinate. And when I get home, I can easily put it in the oven, put it on the stove, whatever we're gonna do for dinner. But it's seasoned, so it's really good. And then also it's like prepped and ready for me to cook so i guess so the final system that i'm going to talk about is having a routine so even though it's the summertime we do like to have a routine my husband works from home but i actually am gone a lot of the day a good portion of the day so when the kids get up they know what they're supposed to do especially the middle child like the nine-year-old the baby she's kind of on her own schedule the teenager's not here right now during the summer but the nine-year-old, when he gets up, so he knows what he's supposed to do. So I have this for him. He can know when he gets up, he's supposed to do his hygiene, eat his breakfast, do his learning fun. We are doing a lot of, what is it called? I'll put it at the bottom of the screen. But it is like the bigger version of ABC Mouse. They've made like a... a elementary school type of one uh, because everyone is doing summer learning or virtual learning so he'll do some of that and then he'll have his physical activity and has no screen time until after his learning time so um this is just another hack because regardless of if i'm in the house if i'm not if i'm work if i'm off he knows what he's supposed to do and routines are essential man they, they really really are all right guys so thank you so much for spending the day with me i thank you for allowing me to give you some of my mom hacks to help me get it all done because honestly i work 10 to 12 hours a day i'm not in the house often or a lot majority of the day i'm outside of the home but i still have to do the mom things i have to do the wife things so how do i get it all done and have a demanding job <laughs> systems systems in place to kind of keep my life together whether it's at work at home allow me to wear all the hats that i need to wear so thank you guys so much for watching please like and subscribe join the family and i'll see you guys in the next video